Welcome on my phone, Future Outlaws. I'm the Andy KKW. You got a great opening for you today. We got another mystery box opening for God because he's a crazy mofo. And uh, he told me to get another about $550, $600 mystery box going for him. So that's what I did. And as you can see in front of you and on the thumbnail, that's going to include this Majestic Star Dragon 10 sealed. We got two Stardust Overdrive, Ancient Prophecy, Raging Battle, and a Crimson Crisis. <laughs> Crimson Crisis packs inside. Hopefully some of them are first edition because that would make sense. Apparently you get sleeves in this one. Like, Konami. They actually cared back then. They cared. But you think that's it? You think that's it? No, we other, we got some other good packs for them. I, I don't skimp. And neither does Gop, to be honest. We got three Trishless Triumph Hidden Arsenal 4 packs. Let's pull that Trish finally, the original printing. Two first edition Cosmo Blazers. Three original printings, or original OG, I think these uh, 2010, 2013, 2010 reprints, one of those two. We got four Shadow of Infinity Unlimbs. We got a premium pack and a turbo pack to end it off. So quite a few goodies down the line. And you know he's not the only one that gets to have fun. I'm going to open up five Hidden Arsenal, f or uh, Hidden Arsenal Fives, as well as five Pharaoh Servant Packs. Because I want to. I want to. So don't forget that sub, that bell, that like, all that good stuff. Leave a comment below. Tell me what your favorite poll was and get that giveaway. It's a Dark Necrophere sealed promo pack of free shipping in the U.S. and all around the world. I almost said that all in one run-on run on sentence. It almost worked. It almost worked. It's okay. We'll make it work because we're going to start off. We're going to start off with this Trishula Triumphs. We're going to go through that. We'll do that in the Cosmos and probably Invasion, and then we'll get into this, and then we'll get into the GX and the Turbo and the Premium because I want to see an ulti dad. I want to see an ulti dad and a Trish and uh, a ghost rare today. We've opened up some good tins lately. Neutrio stink bug. I think that's actually like a buck. Stink bug. Fable Ganesha. Neutrio butterfly. Neo flame Veil origin. Fabled cerebral. Wasn't he actually like, he just recently got reprinted again in a way. Cause I remember there was like a star pat or there's a star foil version of him. That was like eight bucks for some reason about a year ago. And he was not Gen X Alley Birdman. That's pretty cool. That's probably worth something. General Ryo, the Ice Barrier. You do not see this card too often. I remember him actually being not terrible. I, for some reason, I recognize him. It's not Trish. I want it to be Trish. Like Trish Stratus. That'd be cool. That's a, that's a powerful card right there. Very powerful. Gen X Alley Bell Flame. Fabled. And what the? F I don't know if I've ever seen this. That is. Molestation. That is what's going on. That is happening in that card. Gen X Alley, Gen X Alley Reliever, and he will relieve you of the sight that you just saw. No original Trish. That was the last of the Hidden Arsenal 4s that I had, unfortunately. There was only a couple. Because, of course, when he came out, people wanted it. Because Trish is amazing. If he hits the field back then, you're like, it's a good day. Dice Nide. Hyper Ancient Shark, Megalodon, the Big Cattle Drive. Come on, Cosmo Blazer, the Garbage Lord. Don't be one. Don't be in Garb City. I want to go to Ghost City. Oh, God, did you see the fucking bad at strike on the back of this one? It took some damage, dude. It had a sword battle. Hazy Flame, Ignition Beast, Ultimate Formation. No! These are supposed to be good packs. What'd you do, bro? What'd you do? Cosmo Blazer, you're supposed to love me. I need water. All right, three. Invasion of Chaos. OGs. Or at least 2013, 2010, something like that. Around that time. Let's pull a goodie. CD. Demok. Not that. Not that. Ketsu Fuba. Not that. Gigantes. I was, uh, I was trying to think of uh, BLS. I couldn't think of BLS. Really? Really? Both of these mystery boxes have been kind of rough so far for him, and I'm starting to feel bad. Like, is my is my is my choice to pack? Like, usually I got the touch. Is this him finally balancing out? Did he get an ultimate rare last time? I can't remember. I think he did. It, like I said, it's he almost never not pulls at least an ulti. Come on, let's see something. Come on, let's see something. Robin Zombly. Zombly. Robin Zombly! Oh my god! Goff, I'm sorry. I'm trying here, dude. I'm trying. Here, let's let me open up some of mine first to build some luck for your for your 10 shit. I'll pull nothing so you can pull everything. Because my birthday's coming up soon. Less than a week. Kishki chain, not the one we want to see. Eagle, moth. <clears throat> Excuse me. Molten whirlwind wall. 
I feel like I haven't seen that card. I've opened up quite a bit of this. That was the same card. Vanity, Ariel, Steel Swarm, Steel Swarm, Cell. Where is Brio? Is it that fucking rare? Or is it like out of the special edition in the back or something? Can you stop? Can you stop? Can you give me a different card? How about a different card? Maybe like one of the four cards that are worth four to five dollars. How about not Gishki Chain? How about that one had a security tag for some reason? Violon Cube Burner, Level Four Sprite, and Gem Knight Fusion in first edition. That might actually be a couple bucks. Oh my God, this has been a rough couple openings right now. This needs to pick back up. We need a biggie, dude. Hopefully, we get a biggie out of that ten. Violon Epsilon. There's a good one in first edition. That's one of the better cards out of the set, actually. So that's a hit. I'm actually gonna sleeve that. Finally. Finally. That's a good card. That's not bad. Violon Vanguard, Blessing, and Forest Sprite. All right. There. I pulled only one good card. So we're going to open up the 10 next, and hopefully you get goodies. Goodies for Gop. Oh, Seal Collectors, look away. It's too late. Why does even, even the 10s had security tags back then? Or security markers. They were not letting you leave, dude. They were not. This is upside down. I'm going to need you to... Holy shit. That's the first edition of Stardust Overdrive. Holy shit. I didn't realize. Okay. Okay. Majestic Star Dragon. That is freaking gorgeous, dude. That is absolutely gorgeous. First edition of Stardust Overdrive. We have some potential here today. Yada would lose his mind if we pull any Yados. He would lose his mind. Two of them? We get two first edition Stardust Overdrives? Okay, I'm excited immediately. I'm like, that might, that's gonna have to be the main event. That has to be. And you even get deck uh, shifters, sliders, whatever the fuck, and they give you sleeves, dude. Gop, they give you sleeves. They care about you. This is amazing. I don't know where that fell out of. First edition Star, okay. Okay. Suddenly, the amped that has the, we have, the ante has been upped. These that's the main event. That and the turbo pack. That's a fact. Turbo pack. That's a fact. Getting back on track. Uh, we've opened up a lot of ancient prophecy lately, so let's open up that first. Amazingly, that's probably the least impressive out of all of these. Crimson Crisis and ancient prophecy are kind of like neck and neck. Blackwing Fane, the Steel Chain, Ancient Forest, dude. First pack. And a Solidarity. What a fucking pack, dude. Beautiful magic cards. We're putting those together. That was like a $10 pack. Those are both four to five bucks right there, dude. That's a good start. Okay, we're picking back up. Picking back up. It was just all hype. All building. All suspense. First edition Yatos. First edition Christia. Give us a secret rare. Dark Tinker, Trojan, Nightwing, Sorcerer. Shining, Shining Silver Force. B list soldier. What a B list actor, man. He could do better. What a B lister. Raging Battle. Uh, honestly, another Phoenix Armor Light or whatever the hell would be pretty sweet. You know, it doesn't have to be a ghost. That looks like a bend. That looks like a bend. Koiki Marrow Guardian, Viking <laughs> Shura, Level Returner, Spell of Pain. It looked like a bend, but it wasn't a bend. It tricked me. It completely tricked me. I 100% thought we had something there. That's okay. That's okay. You better saving all the luck for the Stardust Overdrive. Let's do our Shadow of Infinities. Actually, let's do my Pharaoh Servants, because those are less impressive than Shadow. And then we'll end off with Gob's Packs. Also, my camera is almost running out, so I'm gonna have to do something here. Steel Ogre Grotto, can I have something? What's up, Ruxton? Tokyo Riba, Bubonic Vermin, Morphing Jar. Hey, we got a Grave Robber. I'm fine with that. I am fine with that. I love Grave Robber. I know it's not great, never will be great, but I still love it. It's a jelly card. It's a jelly card. I'm fine with that. Can we pull a Buster Blader? That's a Yugi card. Ground Collapse. These feel slick as shit, dude. Red Moon, baby. The all-seeing white tiger. He doesn't see the rare that I'm about to pull. That's uh, that's what's about to happen. <coughs> Jinzo. It's going to be Imperial Order. It's 
So it's like three dollars somehow. Flying Kamakiri. These are the slickest original cards ever. You can tell they're from the legend. Ooh, we got something. <laughs> this is the darkest card of all time. I can't see it. Parasite, parasite. Okay, at least I'm pulling shit. That was that early too. I think it was. Yeah, because th these must be the. Because in 2010, that's when they first started doing the rare and the hollow. Okay, that's good. To, uh, like, it can be early. I don't know if it was both times. Two for four or two for three? Not bad, man. Seven completed. Noble Venom Extermination. Harpy's Brother. I like that it's still called Harpy's Brother. They didn't errata that until way later than Sky Scout. I swear to God, it was before this. Swear to God. Yeah, they're PSV E003. All right, let's end off with a uh, Buster Blader. I want to see a Buster Blader. We got something. Oh my God, no way! No way! I want to see a Buster Blader! <laughs> Holy shit, okay. Okay, this instantly shot up to like a fucking 8.5. No way, I turned the fuck out of that. Buster Blader, and honestly, these might be kind of uncommon because they're like just from the Euro... Like, Euro unlimbs are not that common. No, no fucking way, dude. I want to see a Buster Blader. I saw 26, and my heart skipped a beat. <laughs> okay. All right. That's okay. Let's keep all that momentum. Let's send my boy home with something good. Just as good. Shadow of Infinity. That was amazing. <laughs> no fucking way. Silent Insect. Let's see a Raviel. Let's get a Raviel. Let's get a Raviel. Damage Condenser. At least you got a Hollow. All right, we're starting off with something. He did not strike out. Dude, we're picking up hard. We're picking up bad. Solidarity and Ancient Forest Damage Condenser. I did not realize those are first edition Stardust Overdrive. Please. Just anything. Anything. I love that set, but I, it's so fucking hard to find. Next to be lost. DD guide, silent insect. Oh my god! Back to back hollows, ruin queen of oblivion. Holy shit, dude! This is like a nine. Like none of them are super duper rare, but like for older packs, this is crazy. I see some damage on the back card. No, nope. you're good. You're good. Holy fuck, dude! Keep it up. Let's get a secret rare uh, uh, metal red dragon from premium pack as well. That'd be sweet. Death Frog, he's always the fourth card. All right, all right, fine. I, like, I wasn't expecting any, like, you're not doing three for three on Shadow Infinity. Come on, dude, come on. Can we do three for four? Three for four, maybe. Grass Phantom, ultimate rare, come on, please. Hero Kid, he's such a kid, he's such a hero. Doom Dozer, at least he got a good rare. Doom Dozer is always good, dude. 2800, special summon, two for four. That was very nice. Okay, those are some good packs. Oh, main event time, premium pack, turbo packs, two Stardust Overdrive, Zera the Mant. That's the one we want to see in Secret Rare. Metal Morph, also good. Red Eyes Metal Dragon, you're getting the good cards, dude. No, Gemini Ips. Marshmallow and Glasses. Actually, I want to say that's one of the better ones. I want to say that's one of the better ones. I could be wrong. But I want to say that actually is one of the rarer ones to get in Secret Rare. I forgot you get two. I, we want to see Zara or Red Eyes in Secret Rare because those are the big cards. But that was actually a pretty nice pull, dude. Oh. Now we get nervous. Come on, Dad. He's tried so many times. And all we pulled is Sangins. They're just... It's always Sangin. Oh, God. There's some damage on the back there. Fusion Gate. Like, if we're going to get Sangin, fine, but, like, let it be something else. No, I saw 20, I saw 2,000-something, and I got excited. Elector Sovereign, a bird, such a cool-looking card. Fucking dad, dude, he's so elusive. Okay, I'm genuinely fucking excited for this. I did not know these had first edition Stardust Overdrive. Gop, good luck, man. I pray we pull you a Christian or Yados. Alien Skilla, Scylla, Slip Summon. Holy shit! No way! 
No way! Whoa. I know it's not the biggest card in the set. I don't. I have no idea how much this is worth. It's got to be something good, you think? No. 10. 10. 10. Fucking ultimate rare first edition. I need to look it up. I'm looking it up immediately. One sec. I need to see how fucking... Tune Magician, Reptilian, and a Quick Draw Synchron. Good common. No way, dude. Congrats. I need to look it up. One sec. That is about $35 to $40 card. Nothing super crazy, but god damn, we only had two packs. God, man, you can't go and fucking open it without pulling an ultimate rare, dude. We got one pack left. Ten. What an opening. What an opening. Buster Blader. Like, honestly, some crazy hollow rates for older packs. Ah! Probably not. Swap Frog, first edition. That's got to be a couple bucks. Earthbound Wave. Attack Pheromones. A Pointer of the Red Lotus. I can't... I really thought this was a hollow just from how, like, dark and weird it looks. That's also probably a couple bucks. Renan, the Light Sword Rogue. Batillion Viper. Ritual of Grace. <gasps> Moray of Greed. Another good common. God damn. That was actually, like, probably almost a $10 pack from just those three commons. So they're probably about $3 a pop. But, dude. Dude. What an opening. What an opening. That Buster Blader call for me. I'm so happy about that. An Explosive Magician first edition ultimate rare. Congrats, man. Congrats. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you all enjoyed the video. That was great. Let me know what your favorite poll was. I'll see you all tomorrow with another one. Woo! I was just not ready for that.